guarantee your safety beyond this point. Hello everybody, Burnt Out Guy here and welcome back. Alright, so we're gonna go meet with uh, Zoe, I think. Zoe Fargo. I think that's the one we're gonna go do. Uh, I think that's right. As long as it doesn't leave this area, we should be good. <laughs> uh, hot on the trail. Something. I think Hot on the Trail is the one that goes with the main quest. Uh, I wonder. Ah, well, well yeah, because the Nasher one is the one that he, he gave me, so we'll go with this what one first. Alright. Oh, sorry about that. Oh, something to collect. Something to sell, man. Something to sell. So, yeah, we're going to go do this one instead, and that way... I think it would probably be better. As long as, well, hopefully we don't leave the area. I shouldn't leave the area. Maybe just go back into another sewer or something. <laughs> it seems like uh, what it is, go to the Dead Wrath safe house, which would be in a sewer, I would assume. Or maybe in a house, you would think. But sewer rats, right? Rat, yeah, dead rats. Ooh, why would you call yourself the dead rats? Really, like... Wouldn't that like kind of like demeanor the the purpose of being scary and all that crap? I don't know. Kind of weird, but it works for them. It works for them because we're gonna go make them dead rats. Nah, that sounds right. All right, so what the hell is this? Uh, ooh, thievery. Oh, that's right up my alley. That's like free for me, isn't it? No, I can't remember. I don't know how those skills work. All right, so I ran all the way around here to go into a house. Ah, a house, excellent. So, what do we got going on in here? We got a save point. Just get some health here. All right, uh, go through this door here. All right, some bad guys over here. Hello. Oh, nice miss. Oh wow, is that big guy? He did some kind of fancy flipping move. Oh, that was pretty neat. Alright, so nothing in here, nothing in here. Alright, let's go. Let's continue out. Alright, oh, there's something blue in here I gotta find. Oh, look at that. They're right on the other side. Oh, yeah, just kicking their ass. Hello, boys. Come get some. Alright, oh, and you use magic. Ooh, that's kind of scary. Yeah, we'll just throw stuff at you then. There you go. How do you like that? Threw all kinds of crap at you. Well, you can go down that way. Uh, nothing over here. Let's rock their ass. Uh, what's this? Oh, oh, okay. That was the... Uh, oh, alright, alright. Kill them and then plant that stuff and it puts them against each other. Alright, alright. I get this, I get this. That way they, they fight each other and kill each other. Then you only have the one to deal with. That's very, very intelligent. Alright, so this guy here hiding in the shadows. Perfect. So that was that. Excellent. So now we'll go meet with Zoe. We'll go get that one. Done. Unless, is there another quest up here? God damn it. Gotta go that way anyways by the looks of it, so... Yes, for the Nashers! And you're all gonna die. For the Nashers. Weird. Why wouldn't it throw? I guess maybe I was limited on my... There, take that. I was limited on my uh, my distance when I was trying to throw those knives. Oh, get over here. Hey. All right. Oh, so going to see that girl was the next mission. Oh, really? You got guts. Take that. And you that. Excellent. Shoot fucking arrows at me, you piece of crap. All right. Let's go over here and talk to this girl. Oh yeah, now we get to go into the. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. All right, I remember this part. Now this is where. The rebels are everywhere. Like Allowing those three, four the missions. Team, the I pretty much well skipped. So like yeah. Oh well, that kind of sucks, but no big deal. And 
the dungeons and stuff like that, I didn't go into any of the dungeons really, like, the not until the quite a ways escape. ago, we actually. Um, I just did the ones from, like, 12 and on, I think, whenever they told me to go in do missions, go into those queues. But that was the first time I did that. I think that was mainly because I had to. I'm not quite sure there, but... We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Oh, there's something else back here to pick up. I like how stuff glows so you know, like, if you've picked it up, you know. Well, not if you've picked it up, but if there's something lying around. Very helpful. Alright, get rid of you. Get over here. You die. Oh, you're focused on that other girl over there. Which is kind of good, actually. Uh, what else is there? That's that. We gotta go through here. Oh, there's something back here. What's here? Oh. I will do. Thank you very much. Oh, an embroidering purse. I mean, is that like an extra item slot uh, thing for me? I'm gonna have to go check that out afterwards. I think it is. That's pretty cool. It is. So you guys, I'm up to four bags that I've found so far. Okay, they're not huge bags on the... Um, but, you know, I, at least I have four bags, right? So let's go here. Probably gotta kick somebody's ass. I'll get some lore. I think I found pretty much well all the lore in my other game too as well, um, up to like where I am. I'm pretty thorough when it comes to looking for crap. Oh, really? There, take that. Turn around, go pick something up, and you shoot an arrow on my back. <laughs> Who do you think you are? Alright, more lore. Excellent. Uh, okay, can I get this thing? Yes, I can. Alright. Sweet. You know, I haven't even started doing any of that in my other game. Oh. Oh, here. Let me just give it to you guys then. You're gonna be stupid like that. Run after the other girl. There we go. Oh, yeah, look at all of them. That's crazy. Looking forward to new skills, though. That's gonna be awesome. Oh, yeah. Take that. Oh, uh, what's this? Engineering. Oh, it broke. Come on, come on, give it to me. Yeah, more, more crap. I have no idea what that stuff does, but whatever, we'll figure it out. All right, anything else in here? Where's this on the wall? How was that? Sword must have flung into the wall, I guess. It's kind of odd. All right, I guess now we can go open this door. Yes, next place. <gasps> Look at that! It's a boss! <laughs> no you won't. Stop lying to him. I'll be right behind you, buddy. I'm coming to kick your ass, too. Alright. Oh yeah, take that. That was awesome. Just get rid of your magic person first. And then that way you're screwed afterwards. There you go. That was a good, good little uh, strategy. Event. Oh, look at that. I got another one. Alright, so let's go check this out. Um, oh, that was just treasure. Crap. Alright, so here's my first knapsack kit. Uh, you can equip it. And then go here. See? So this is the first one I get. And holds quite a bit of slots. The other ones so far that I've picked up are just two rows. But still, it's extra slots, man. Extra slots. Um, so every once in a while you're going to find an item like this that's unidentified. Uh, when it's red, it's for somebody else's class, so don't bother identifying it because you're just wasting your scrolls on somebody else's class. It will make the value of that item go up, mind you, but unless you're just going to throw it away and garbage it, don't waste your, um, yeah, don't waste your scrolls on them. So you save your scrolls. Uh, so much better. Uh, that tip. That's a tip. That's one of my tips I'm giving all of you. <laughs> Yeah, a good tip is to save your scrolls on um, on that stuff. Because if it's just crap you're going to pick up and throw away, you may as well, or sell, you know, just don't waste everywhere. it. It's not worth it. Watch out for um, all no, right. Ready for our next move. So now we get you're going? that and Puzzle. that. All right. So the lakefront property one over here is just, uh, you got to burn some crates. So we're going to go and burn some crates. Yes, that we will. Ah, oh, really? You all see me? Here, take this. 
There, my cause is just to <laughs> kick your ass. All right, so let's go burn some crates. Yeah, I'm telling you, the horse makes it so much better. Oh, look at that! I have. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Uh, I did go up a level. Oop, sorry, wrong one. There we go. Uh, that's my special one, so I'll do that. Yeah, there we go. So now my special one is upgraded. It'll hit a little bit stronger, I'm assuming. I didn't bother reading what it did, so... Yeah, just upgrade that shit. And I found out, uh, you know, like... Quite a bit of stuff about this game. So as we go along and we discover new things, I'll be able to explain quite a bit to you, which is pretty helpful. Um, Alright, so there. I uh, got our health. Now we can go into here. So here's the first crate. Maybe I can do it before. Yes, excellent. <laughs> I might have hurt myself a little bit there, but no big deal. Awesome. Let's see, there we go. More crap for me. That's one crate. Here's another one. Get rid of these guys. Take that. I'm gonna burn another crate. So now it's two. Here's three. I right, got out of there just in time. Crap. Oh, that's okay. You're really annoying, buddy. Seriously. There, that wasn't so bad. Alright, burn more crates. Awesome. Awesomely awesome. Oh, there's one right out in the open here. I don't have to fight anybody. It's really good. That's probably going to catch me on fire. Nope, I got away and fine. Here, we'll just pull these guys out here. Awesome. Hey, right, take that. Oh, yeah. No running. You stay here. Alright, collect this crap. More crap to collect. Oh, there is something up there, I think. I think that's a religion one, though. I'll have to go check. Right. Yeah, all of them done. Now, raid the Nasher's headquarters. Alright, oh, yeah, I can actually take part in that. Ah, uh, the only one I had, and it broke. Oh, that's fine. Alright, so let's go down here and kick some more Nasher ass. Oh, yeah, take that. Excellent. Death. That's to all of you. Did I pick up something new and better? Uh, so when I get to level 9, yeah, I notice this game, what it does is it gives you stuff for higher levels all the time. Like, you're going to run into that often where you're like a level or two behind in order to get that item. So it's kind of odd, but I think they would uh, put it so you'd have like same level crap, but no. Well, yes. Sorry. I hate to lie. Get rid of you because you're really annoying. Aha! Oh my god. You're almost dead. There we go. Yeah, take that. So, that's done, done. More stuff to collect. And now let's go into their headquarters and kick some ass! So, looking forward to getting my next, uh, my next skill. I'm kind of wondering what it is. Okay, so there's a fireplace over here. I think we should take advantage of that free healing, right? Look at that. With uh, s with the drow, you uh, you heal pretty damn fast. It's pretty funny. Um, you're like three times as fast as everybody else. It's awesome. So you step on those things, and you get like full health almost instantly. It's great. All right, so let's go over here for the Nashers. You're all idiots. Take that. There. Oh, there's a big guy. We'll dodge you. Aha! I see that. Okay, take this. Ah! Alright. Kick the ass. There we go. Uh, simple whatever. I guess it's crafting stuff. So what's this over here? Uh, lore. Yeah, right on. Nothing else back here. Because most of these areas you can only come into like once, eh? so it's always good to have a look around to make sure that you kind of collected everything. Because it would really suck ass if uh, you didn't. 
Alright, so if I'm not mistaken, this is the one that has the dungeoneering kit up here. So you gotta walk her along this railing here. Do this. Pushes out that log. And then you can come and take that bag. And get the stuff from it. So that's something I figured out. Uh, I don't know if anybody else knew that that was there, but that's something else for you. So let's go around here right quick. I'm just not sure if there's anything else. Alright, so it was just an arcane one there. Alright, so we're good. I think that's how I discovered that. I came up here to go have a look, and I seen that bag over there. So I was like, aha! And then I seen the dungeoneering thing, and I was like, woohoo! So yeah, this is uh, another little area. Anything here? Nope. Alright, so we're good to go down. Nothing under here. And there's a lock on the a switch on the floor anyways, and that opens the door. So if you're Oh yes I can. Watch me. You'd be amazed at what I can do. There, take that. Slam you right into the ground, bitch. Alright, what's next? Alright, that's nothing there. Is, uh, I hope you guys all find this pretty thorough, with, like walking through the areas and showing what's available in the areas and all that there. So I don't want to use that uh, skill of mine just yet. There we go. There. Give it a little bit to everybody, so that way you know it kind of stuns them as you're going around. All right, anything back here? Alright, there's just uh, nature kits, so if you had a nature kit on you. It's always good to kind of like, after a while, when you start getting some more money, you can actually like stock up on all those kits and stuff like that, and they're pretty beneficial to you if you're going to run through these areas by yourself and uh, farm them. Um, if when you're crafting later on, uh, you're going to need a lot of this stuff, so... Ah, oh, really? Ah, oh, how dare all of you. Take that. Alright. I seen something back here. Thievery. So see this is right up my alley. Bam. Oh, I found some cool stuff. I have to figure out what that is later on. And I will inform you on all of that. Alright. Because I know that these artifacts and stuff like that you can get and there's like ruining and refining, uh, refining runes and all this stuff. Oh man, it's so insane. Alright, so this is the guy I saved up my power for. So we're gonna go in here and kill his adds right quick. And then that way we can use the power just on him. Hopefully that'll work. Oh, really? Ouch. There, there take that bastard. That kind of stunned him a little bit. Oh. Wow, good throw. Or good hit. Alright, get the hell away from you. Kick your ass. I'm gonna stun you again. Come on, hit him. Ah, no. Get away, get away. Alright, use a potion. Alright, that's good. Take out some of these guys. I know their ads are just gonna keep coming back, but as long as there's like an ad or two less than what they normally is. Yeah. I can get rid of him pretty decently fast there. There we go. So that's done. There's no more no more guys in here. Alright, so we're just going to go have a look around the room before we go and collect stuff. Uh, I just want to make sure that uh, we have everything here. And there's nothing hiding anywhere. Alright, so nothing over there. That's where we came in from. It's over here. Got a religion. So if you had religion, you can get that one in the corner. And we should be good. Now this is like lore. Alright. Now when you grab the crate, there's like... See? <laughs> I think that happens no matter what, really, to be honest with you. So if you were like low health or whatever, you would get like screwed over by that. Alright, so we got a blade. Let's go check that out. Uh, that would be my other one over here. So it's recommended. Definitely recommended. So let's put it on my... F on my this hand right here, my main hand. See, there we go. That's a lot better. Uh, Crown of Neverwinter. See, once I get to level nine, I'll be able to use that. Uh, 
same with that. So as soon as I get back and cash these in, I should be able to hit level 9 and be able to put that stuff on. So that will be good. That will be good. Excellent. Let's go cash this crap in then. Go back to Protector's Enclave. Uh, before we get there though, we have to go and stop by that one guy and cash in that quest. And then that will be today's episode. Alright, so let's go and get to level level 9 by cashing in these quests and make our way down there. Try to avoid these guys and uh, avoid a fight for nothing. What's that on the wall? That like, looks like lore. Examine the graffiti. Yeah, see, there you go. It was lore. Excellent, excellent. You never know when you're going to find stuff like that. No. Always got to look for the... Uh, what are you? Old Jerry? This is my questions. What kind Lost gun! You sound crazy, old Jerry. <laughs> well, screw you. Aw, oh, man, really? Um... Do I not have any other quests though? Uh, journal. Oh, I guess I didn't. I just have that one. Awesome. Alright. So let's go back to Protector's Enclave. And we can go and cash that quest in. I thought I actually had the other one. Oh, I guess it finished when I, as soon as I did whatever I had to do. That's good. It saves me from having to run back and cash it in anyways. The more the merrier. Fast, fast, fast. Bloody load time. Takes forever. Let's load. But so far, how are you all enjoying the game? I hope you all like it. Um, I'm enjoying it. I'm going to continue doing these whether <laughs> I get a lot of watches or not because it's a, it's a fun game. It really is. There's a lot to it. And because it's also a free-to-play game, I think that encourages me a lot more to play it. And as long as I can maybe find out how to get that zen with the market there and all that good stuff without having to put any money in and if i can sell all those astral diamonds the ones i'm going to collect uh i think that would be very awesome and then i'll just flood the market with, <laughs> with astral diamonds <laughs> and uh hopefully uh i can help bring down the price too um because I guess you gotta kinda like play the market myself too and see when prices are up high and when prices are up low. So when prices are l kinda high, I should kinda sell it then, really, and make more money off of it. So. Alright, so now we get a whole bunch more quests, so we're just gonna go and accept all of these. Because uh, listening to all of them would just take bloody forever. So. While investigating Let's the go Nash to in the here and first, and then she was sure you would talk to me today, and it's a never-ending stream of messengers to remind me to tell you to go see her. Yes. Please go talk to her. <laughs> Be cautious, just between you and me. She seems a bit off. <laughs> that's pretty funny. All right, so uh, that's it, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the episode, and we'll see you next time. Peace out.